there's no denying that the social media generation has a deficit of decent people to look up to. The more shallow and self-serving people become, the more the next generation tries to emulate them and work towards self-satisfaction. Very few who rise to fame work for a greater cause than their own happiness. We see this in a big way on platforms like Instagram where life can be filtered and people can be duped. We're supposed to look up to the Kardashians and the Kaepernicks of the world, and hate President Trump because his complexion isn't on point. We can safely say that our culture is headed down the toilet when we're more worried about social media hits than the lives of our fellow humans. That's what Daily Mail reports that Instagram superstar and failed Navy SEAL Dan Bilzerian was faced with when a real hero called him out. A Medal of Honor winner and Marine Corps veteran has slammed the king of Instagram Dan Bilzerian for filming himself running away moments after he saw a woman shot in the dead, sick, in Las Vegas. Veteran Dakota Meyer, who is married to Sarah Palin's daughter Bristol, says that when faced with real danger, Bilzerian simply ran away. Meyer took to social media and called out the so-called king of Instagram on his own platform. This is why children shouldn't classify heroes by their followers or their photos? This is what kills me about people like you. Always plain operator dress up and so, so tough when the cameras are on. A woman just got shot in the head and you are running away filming that's not what operators do. Please stop trying to be someone you're not. People are dying. You're running away not helping them and pretending it's worthy of a video is disgusting. Now, this might seem like a harsh assessment if you're not familiar with Bilzerian or his public persona. This would be human has made a pretty big splash by jet setting, partying and attempting to join the Navy SEALs. The multi-millionaire playboy has tried to join the elite fighting force multiple times but never quite made the cut. Professional poker player Bilzerian who tried and failed to become a Navy SEAL, constantly posts photos of himself alongside his arsenal of weapons, working out topless, or surrounded by a bevy sick, of Instagram models. Bilzerian had entered the Navy SEAL training program in 2000 but failed to graduate despite several attempts. He was reportedly dropped from the program for a safety violation on the shooting range. Meyer's attack came after Bilzerian posted a video in the immediate aftermath of the shooting, of himself fleeing the carnage at the Route 91 Harvest Festival, where he claimed to have seen a girl get shot in the head. Holy F, a girl just got shot in the effing head, he says, as he runs away. This is so effing crazy. Meyer, on the other hand, is a decorated Marine with a lot of experience running toward dangerous situations. Not only was he awarded the Medal of Honor for his actions during the Battle of Ganjgal on September 8, 2009, in Afghanistan, he is also the second youngest living Medal of Honor recipient in the history of the United States. He also has two children with Bristol Palin, Sailor Grace and Adley Bay. There are a lot of people who could have made the same comments and been accused of not putting their money where their mouth is, but this is not one of those people. Meyer spent years putting his life on the line for each of us, and Bilzerian has spent years partying so hard he's had multiple heart attacks. Bilzerian has also had a few brushes with the law that would lead one to believe that the boys and girls scanning the gram might need to find someone else to look up to. Here's more from our source about his less than pristine past. On December 9, 2014, Bilzerian was arrested at Los Angeles International Airport on bomb-making charges. Those charges were dropped but he appeared in court in February 2015, where he pleaded no contest to negligently failing to extinguish a fire in the open and was fined $17,000. In August 2014, Bilzerian was banned from a Miami nightclub for allegedly kicking model Vanessa Castaño in the face during a brawl. Castaño later filed a $1 million lawsuit against Bilzerian for her injuries. Later that same year, Bilzerian landed himself in another legal matter when he threw porn star Janice Griffith off the roof of a house, who broke her foot when she landed on the edge of a swimming pool, as part of a hustler photoshoot. Bilzerian even announced a bid to run for President of the United States in 2015, but pulled out and endorsed Donald Trump later that year. The 36-year-old, he calls himself the king of Instagram, appears to spend most of his time playing poker and posing with Insta models. 
he appears to have been at the music festival when the gunman opened fire.